What is going on, guys? Uh, today, um, I'm doing a little bit of an experiment. Uh, this is kind of like a new trend at my school. Um, I call them wingers. You might call them something else. But it's when you take one or two or however many rubber bands, and you take them, and you go like this, and you have like a little object right here, and go like this, and fling it at someone, something, anything. Um, but today, um, I'm going to teach you how to make a very, very accurate and powerful winger. Um, so, what we're going to need today is a rubber band, or two rubber bands, or how many ever rubber bands you want it. Um, I found that if you put more rubber bands on it, it will decrease the speed a little bit, but, and it, it'll be harder to lock back, and it'll seem like it's going to go fast, it's not... I can, and I'm sorry about the background music, or background, because my mom is having a conversation in the other room, um, yeah, and we're gonna need, we're gonna need a piece of paper, piece of paper, and scissors, and a pencil or any flat edge kind of thing, so, what we are gonna do, take the paper, and we're gonna take, we're gonna fold it, Hamburger style. Match it up as smoothly as possible. And I'm just going to put it on the desk and fold it. And what you can do... Here. What you can do... Yeah, my desk is kind of like... Eh. What you can do for this is you can take this and just move it... Move it down the side and... I, I, I can't do it with one hand, but, so, um, yeah, you can move it down with, okay, you move it down with uh, one hand and kind of just sharpen out the, the kind of, uh, little crease right there. Alright, now we're going to take it again and fold it again hamburger style. And again, sharpen out the creases. Now, this is where it gets... I'm not going to say tricky, but it gets kind of complicated. So what you're going to do is you're going to take... So you're going to have this two, these two flaps. You're going to take one flap and fold it to... And fold it to this edge. Now, this doesn't have to be perfect, but if it is, good. Good again. Um, and then we take... it. Uh, we take the same flap and fold it again, and just do that. Same thing on the other side. Alright, so now we have this. Now, if you open it up, it'll kind of, if if you open it up, it'll kind of look like like that. Um, that just means that you did it correctly. Um, now, what you want to do is you just want to open. Make sure you can open these two parts up to make kind of like that shape. And then fold it back. And then just to make sure that it's not all messed up. Um, then you know, just cut little strips. Don't cut big strips because it'll mess up your ringer. Alright, so just from that little thing, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve winners. Uh, you're only going to need one. So you take your rubber bands, you put them on the top of your index finger and bottom of your, or the top of your, sorry, sorry about that, um, the top of your, your top of your thumb. So if you have your hand like this, it should be like.
like that. So here, I'll do it like this. So ready? So go in, up, and then put your thumb through. All right. Now we're gonna take this winger, and it's gonna it's gonna look like this, okay? At the at the open edge. Now what you're gonna do? You fold that in half, Hamburg style again. And where you folded it, like on the inside where you folded it, put that inside. Put that inside right there. And you want it kind of in the middle. Um, most people to aim, they go like they go like that. Um, but if you're just looking to like mess around and uh, you know, just kind of like freak people out, you can just go. Now you can you heard that right? You heard you heard that noise. That was the noise of just pain for the other person. So so again, I'm gonna take my winger, take my rubber band, and you can also do this. Put it in the middle of the see not not folded, not folded winger. Put it in the middle. You put it in the middle like this, and then kind of wrap your fingers around like that. And exactly. Um, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoy. I hope you enjoyed that little how to build a powerful winger video. Um, like and subscribe for more videos like this. I I'm sorry if I haven't been posting lately. Um, yeah, I just been I just been busy. Uh, all right. Uh, See you bros in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed this. Like and comment if you did. And see you in the next one. Peace.